So this question says one pound of grapes costs two dollars. So I'm gonna just write that down. One pound equals two dollars. At this rate, how many dollars will C pounds of grapes cost? So C pounds equals, I don't know how many dollars, I'll say X dollars. I notice that all of my answer choices contain a variable, which usually is a telltale sign that I can use the strategy that I call plug in your own number, right? So anytime I see a variable or variables in the answer choices, I will tend to use this strategy of plugging in my own number. So the way this strategy works is I get to make up a value for C. So let's say C is equal to two. I get, I get to then solve the question based upon that value, right? Which in this case just means, hey, if C is two, that means I have two pounds of grapes. And because the question told me that each pound is $2, I would expect that two pounds must be four dollars right so i i answer the question kind of outside the realm of even looking at the answer choices for right now and then my next step is to see well which one of the answer choices matches the answer that i just got so i replace the variable with the number that i'm plugging in right in this case being two sorry about that so let's see what happens when we do that so for answer choice a i get two times two well that's four but for answer choice B, I get two plus two. So that's also four. Answer choice C, I get one. So that's definitely not what I'm looking for because I'm looking for $4. And answer choice D, I also get one. So D is out as well. So the problem here is, well, I get two options. And I'll just erase this so we can see it clearly. I get two options that give me the four that I was looking for. So what do I do? Um, usually, or some of the time when you use plugging your own number, you will only have one answer, correct? Like in this case, if there was only one of the options that gave us four. But anytime you have multiple options providing a correct answer, we just start over. We give a brand new number to plug in. So let's say I try C is three. So if C was three, that means I have three pounds. And that means I would expect that the cost for those three pounds would be $6, right? $2 per pound, I have three pounds, so $6. So let's do this process again. I know that C is out and D is out because those did not work when I tried my first option, being C equals two. So those are out, they cannot come back into the game. So now when C is equal to three, I get two times three, which is six, which is what I want, and two plus three, which is equal to five, which is not what I want, and therefore answer choice A is the correct answer okay so that's the game plug in your own number solve based upon plugging that number in check to find out which answers match or which answer matches your solution and if you ever have a situation where more than one answer matches the solution you're looking for we just do it again right with a different number